A person deposits rupees twenty thousand in a bank, which pays an interest of four percent per annum, compounded continuously. How much amount will be accumulated in his account after five years? So here, a person is depositing an amount of rupees twenty thousand in a bank for a tenure of. Five years. So this is first year. This is second year, third year, fourth year, and fifth year. Now per annum, the rate of interest is four percent. So four percent is the rate of interest per year. However, the interest is being compounded continuously. So what this means is that every instant. The interest accrued is being added to the principal at the beginning of that instant, and that amount becomes the principal amount for the next instant, and that instant can be as granular as possible. So, for continuous compounding, we know that the amount at the end of the tenure is equal to P, which is the principal, multiplied by E, which is a constant, to the power n one r one divided by hundred. Here n one is the number of years, and r one is the rate of interest per year. So in this case, P is twenty thousand. N one is five years. And R one is four, so A is equal to twenty thousand multiplied by E, and E is a constant which is equal to two point seven one eight two eight to the power of n one multiplied by R one, which is five multiplied by four, which is twenty divided by hundred. So A is equal to twenty thousand multiplied by two point seven one eight two eight to the power of twenty divided by hundred is one by five. Or A is equal to twenty thousand multiplied by two point seven one eight two eight to the power of one by five, and one by five is also point two. So let me pull my calculator here. So two point seven one eight two eight to the power of point two multiplied by twenty thousand, and this is equal to twenty four thousand four hundred and twenty eight rupees. So A is equal to twenty four thousand. Four hundred and twenty-eight rupees.